Yeah, or no, I do those uh, harmonics where you pinch it on this side. Um, behind the nut. The, yeah, behind the nut. It's uh, yeah. on a cleaner setting, it's kind of easier. But there's so many things you can do with it. Um, there's a lot of things you can do. Because that's your major with your. And we're gonna get technical, and all the people are that are guitar players are like. Yeah. But yeah, it's um that's your major, and your first fret is your major, and you just bend your string up and half step. So. And the same thing with A. So many things you can do with that, and you'll see me doing that throughout the uh, throughout the early evening. Uh, what other questions? I love the black side of little kid there. I got a question, John. Oh, jeez, hold on, that little right. kid. Who or what inspired you to play guitar? Uh, I loved, you know, just like any of you guys, I love uh, Jimi Hendrix, and, and I love, you know, like Eddie Van Halen, of course. And, I always have epiphanies for my life, and uh, definitely, it's like, if I see someone and it hits me, you know, it's like, and I still get inspired today, I mean, I love a ton of guitar players, you know, still today, and I love hearing new people and going, oh man, that guy's awesome, and I just love being inspired, so, I mean, hopefully one day I'll come see you guys play, and, you know, I'm totally into hearing new people and getting inspired. Oh, okay. Hey, John, what's up? Hey. You're awesome. Dude. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I got a question. Um, it's kind of like the other one, but uh, who, is there any musician you still want to work with that you haven't got a chance to yet? Well, yeah, I kind of set, set my uh, standards a little high. Like, I love, uh, I love Paul McCartney. I love him, yeah, I love him, but <laughs> um, Paul McCartney, you know, like all those, like, crazy cats like that. Um, I love to work with Prince one day, believe it or not, but, you know, I think he's so awesome. But I was recording the, uh, Hollywood record and uh, and um, Prince was like uh, his his tech um, you know I know his, his guitar tech and, and his tech said that Prince was looking through a guitar magazine and he goes you know, tell me about this guy this job five guy you know Prince talks like this <laughs> and so uh, I was like oh man uh, you know and so Takumi called me and he goes hey Prince I think he's gonna call you to come and jam and stuff in the Thank studio you. And I was like, all right, all right. So I'm recording the Hollywood record, and my phone rings, and it's like a um, Minneapolis number. And I said, hello, and he goes, what's happening? And I, was like, I was like, oh man, that's Prince on the phone. So I was like, oh man. He's like, you know, I wanted you to come down to the studio, but I couldn't because I was recording the album and stuff like that, so you know. But almost coulda, shoulda, woulda. But you know, who knows? Maybe one day. Oh, you got a question? Yeah, yeah. Um, you're, you're like a really good guitarist. Thank you. I've listened to you a lot. Thank you. So, and, uh, I have two questions. Like, um, was it was it like an experience, like a really good experience to play with Marilyn Manson? Yeah, it was. It was great. You know, I was such a fan. Like all you guys, you know, I was a huge Manson fan before I got in the band, and I was like. Oh, kick ass, you know, I'm psyched, I get to, you know, I didn't really even audition, he kind of just took me out to lunch and gave me my name and, and said, cool, let's, uh, let's do this. And our first gig was the MTV Video Music Awards, you know, uh, for Dope Show, and that was our first gig, you know, so I didn't know what was going on, you know, he just came in in his crazy outfit, and like, and a lot of people don't know this, but like, I swear to you guys, like two minutes before we were supposed to go, go on, he goes, I gotta take a piss. And he had this, you know, that that plastic, like, weird, crazy suit on. So what they had to do, they had to cut, like, a hole here so he could take a whiz. So I don't know if you watched the, um, if 
you watch the video, maybe you can see that. You too. <laughs> and um, do you um, like Enrique Iglesias? Oh, sure, why not? Of course. <laughs> Who doesn't? <laughs> All right, we're going to do another song. Um, this one is off of... This one's off Vertigo. And, uh, and this one's called Shoot the Foot You know, now that I think about it, because I love Trent Reznor, but I went on tour with this uh, artist named Leah Andrioni, and like, who's no one's like heard of. They're like, Ooh, Leah Andrioni. But um, I, so I missed out on the session. So Halford went to New Orleans, hung out with Trent, you know, and all this stuff. I mean, I know Trent, but I'd never really worked with him, worked with him. So I, you know, I missed out on that because I was like six weeks in France. So um, unfortunately, I got to miss that. But, 